Hiya, I'm Casper, and welcome to your video review for Percy Jackson and the Olympians, Season 1. Well, really, Episodes 1 through 3, but that's all that's out right now. It's going to be 8 episodes, only 3 are out, they're doing them every Tuesday. Anywho, <laughs> so, uh, this TV show is based off a book series, and, or book, book series. There are some graphic novels as well. Haven't read any of the books or the graphic novels, but I know they exist. I did watch the two movies that came out a few years ago. I know one of the complaints that people had about the movies is that they aged up the characters to be like tail end of high school rather than the middle school or freshman that is what they have in this show, which I think is probably closer to the book. So I enjoyed the movies well enough. They didn't like, they weren't, they didn't blow me away entirely, but I liked the actors that they had in it. I liked, you know, it was good. I enjoyed it. This one. The kid who, who is, plays Percy Jackson is the... He also played young Ryan Reynolds in, I think it's called The Adam Project. So he played young Ryan Reynolds, and he did such a fantastic job. Like, you have to watch that movie, because he is young Ryan Reynolds. It is so awesome to watch that. <laughs> it's hilarious. Fantastic job. He was also in Secret Headquarters, which is a much more kid-focused movie. I enjoyed it well enough, but it's definitely, definitely geared towards kids in that. Uh, link in the description down below for reviews of them, if I did reviews for those two movies. But, this movie, sorry, this show is also very much geared towards kids. So, there's not a whole lot going on that, that keeps me interested. Part of it is because they, it's an action-adventure show, so there's a lot of fighting and maybe death and, 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 you know, slashy, slashy, stabby, like, there's a whole lot of that going on, but... They have to keep it rated G or PG, so there's so much that they cut around or edit in such a way or figure out ways to have reasons for things not to be bloody or shown that way, and it just kind of, it just, it distracts from what's going on in the story for me. Also, you know, it just, yeah, just the dialogue. It's clunky. Percy, the guy who plays Percy, does the best job that he can with it, but it's just, it's not... It does not flow. We are three episodes of eight into this show, and it is just clunky, 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 like there is no flow to the show. Uh, also, while I do like the actor who plays Kyron, uh, the wheelchair guy, like I, I do like that actor. I've seen him in a couple other things, and I think he does a good job with those other things. I did not like him, and I did not like Annabeth. Uh, I did not like the actors that they chose for those roles, for this movie. Uh, link in the description down below for more detailed reason as to why, but yeah, so I did not care for their choices there, and clunky dialogue. Also, the, the budget, <sighs> I feel like it had maybe the total equivalent of budget of the Goosebumps show that came out a little while ago. In episode one, they fight a Minotaur a little bit, like it's on screen enough. It's decent CGI, it, it works, but then later on, there's like this like war game scene where all the kids have like what are supposed to be real swords and shields. And it looks like they got a whole bunch of the 300 style shields, like from the movie 300, but from Spirit Halloween. And I just don't think that they are quite enough high quality or realistic looking enough uh, to be the like strong metal shields that they are supposed to be in this TV show. So some budget things some clunky dialogue, some actor choices that they made that I just don't agree with, and just general very kid-focused nature of it, I'm not going to continue watching this show. There's five more episodes. If what I had described sounds like something you're interested in, great. Hope you enjoy it. But this is the only review that you'll get from me of Percy Jackson and the Olympians TV show. So thanks for watching. Bye!